Hello students, in the previous lesson we had discussed about atom and its structure. Students, all the substances in the universe are made up of atoms. Atoms are so small that if we want to see them, we need to magnify them to make them look a billion times bigger than their actual size. In today's lesson, we will discuss about element. Students, there are 118 elements out of which 94 occur naturally on earth and the rest are prepared artificially. An element is the substance in which the atoms are chemically identical having the same atomic number. Chemically identical means that the atoms have the same chemical properties and have the same atomic number means that the number of protons of the atoms are same. Elements cannot be broken down into simpler units by ordinary chemical process. In simple words, an element is a substance that is made up of the same kind of atom. For example, the element silver is made up of only silver atoms. The element hydrogen is made up of only hydrogen atoms. To understand the definition of element more clearly, let's look at this picture over here. Now this picture includes a gold ring. Student, gold is an element. Now if we take a particle of this gold ring, you can see that it is made up of atoms. Now all these atoms are gold atoms. But how do we know that these are gold atoms? Because all these atoms are chemically identical. It means they have the same chemical properties and they have the same atomic number. It means the number of protons of all these atoms is same, which belong to the element gold. So gold is an element that is made up of only gold atoms. Now let's take another example. Here you can see a glass of water. Students, the molecular formula of water is H2O. It means that one molecule of water is made up of two atoms of hydrogen and one atom of oxygen. Now how do we tell these atoms apart? That is how do we know which atom belongs to hydrogen and which atom belongs to oxygen? Students, we can identify the atoms from their atomic number. The atomic number of oxygen atom is 8 and the atomic number of hydrogen atom is 1. It means the number of protons in oxygen atom is 8 and the number of protons in hydrogen atom is 1. So among all these atoms, the atoms with the atomic number 8 all belong to the element oxygen and the atoms with the atomic number 1 all belongs to the element hydrogen. So the atomic number defines to which element an atom belongs to. So an element is a substance in which the atoms are chemically identical. All these atoms are chemically identical and they have the same atomic number. Symbol. A symbol is a short abbreviated name of an element. They are derived from their English and Latin names. Students, symbols are the short form of elements. Now, the name of some elements are derived from their English names and some are derived from the Latin names. These are the symbols of elements that are derived from the English names. The symbol of hydrogen is H, helium HE, lithium Li, beryllium BE, boron B, carbon C, nitrogen N, oxygen O, fluorine F, neon NE, magnesium Mg, aluminium Al, silicon Si, phosphorus P, sulfur S, chlorine Cl, calcium C, 
Ca, manganese Mn, nickel Ni, zinc Zn, bromine Br, barium Ba, iodine I, cobalt Co, platinum Pt, bismuth Bi, chromium Cr, and arsenic As. Students, these are the symbols that are derived from the Latin names. Sodium in Latin is natrium and the symbol is Na. Potassium in Latin is calium, symbol is K. Iron, ferrum, Fe. Copper, cuprum, Cu. Silver, Argentum AG Gold Aurum AU Mercury Hydrogyrum AG Lead Plumbum PB Tin Stanum SN Antimony Stibium SB Tungsten Wolfworm W Students kindly learn the name of all elements and their symbols and complete your home task.